First of all, I'm going to give you my art collecting theory. I get things because I like them. It's the first thing. The second reason I get things is because I like the artist and I want to help them. The third thing is that I despise the artist and it's the only way I can get rid of them. Okay? <laughs> In that descending scale of values. But uh, there are a number of things that I really, really like a lot. Like that nude, the famous bar nude. I, I got that because I felt every bar should have a nude on a rug, you know? And, uh, and so Kitty Wallace used to hang around the old joint and the, you know, I had the rug because my brother shot that polar bear and the model hung out at the joint. She was a junkie, she, she OD'd not too long after that. But uh, so I put it all together and Kitty Wallace hated doing that. She found it very demeaning. Subsequently, she was very proud of it, but, uh, but she felt she was prostituting her art, blah, blah, blah. <laughs> but anyway, still I think one of the better bar nudes. It's pure kitsch, but what the hell. <laughs> you were mentioning the, uh, you know, Jesus over there with the guitar. Well, that was given to me. It was from a wrecked church in Nicaragua, you know, when they had their, had their revolution. One of the bartenders who was, had been a, who was a, quite a good artist and been an art teacher, and I said, can you fix this up? It was all beat to hell. And uh, so he restored it, and he said, it looks like it should be holding a guitar. I said, give him a guitar and hold the guitar. I've always denied that that's Jesus. I mean, sometimes you get a true believer in here that's horrified. They think it's a travesty. But, uh, you know, if there really was a Jesus, it was probably a composite figure like so many other people from mythology. But uh, if he was like he was, then he was probably a hippie. They just didn't have guitars then. <laughs> <laughs>